Weather First with meteorologist Joshua Rivas. Alrighty, and good Saturday, everybody. Hope you're enjoying your Saturday out there. We've had the clouds around this morning so far, but I think we'll see a little bit more sunshine by this evening. Most importantly, it feels pretty nice out there. We had that front move through on Friday and it's bringing in those pleasant conditions. We'll continue through Sunday, except Sunday just looks absolutely fantastic. I'll show you that in just a second. Now for next week, it looks like we may continue the comfortable conditions through about Tuesday, the early part of Tuesday next week. And then after Wednesday, it looks like we're pretty much set in stone to see that high pressure take control. We'll stay dry and then we'll see the increasing humidity and temperatures uh, possibly well above normal next week. We're talking about inland areas maybe seeing a spotty 90. Now local computer model showing for Sunday. Look at this. <laughs> Just fantastic as we go into Sunday with mostly clear skies. We may see crystal clear skies on Sunday. It looks that nice. Now we see a few clouds, but overall really nice on Sunday, Monday, maybe a few more clouds coming back into our area as we develop that easterly wind around the surface area of high pressure. So let's talk about that. We're looking at the surface area of low pressure that brought us the showers early Friday quickly out of the picture. Then here comes that high pressure again. No change in the forecast. It will move towards the southeast by the at least two Tuesday of next week. So Monday still looks pretty nice. It's going to warm up, but it's going to feel pretty pleasant. So it's better in the shade, but it's going to feel not as humid as it will feel by the end of next week, where we're talking about mid to upper 80s and dew points back into 60s. It's going to feel a little bit more humid next late next week. Mid to upper levels, zonal flow west to east. That means temperatures uh, they're near normal or just slightly above. And also we have the jet stream aloft as well, supplying some moisture. That's why you have the clouds for today. But by tomorrow, we'll begin to see that trough kind of clip us tomorrow. So maybe bring us those cooler temperatures at least two more mornings, Sunday and Monday, with temperatures in the low 50s and uh, mostly clear for Sunday. And then by next week, here comes that ridge of high pressure, very strong for this time of year. And again, all that means is our temperatures are going to soar into the 80s. Temperature map here keeping all the cool temperatures well towards our north. Again, we may see some spotty upper 40s both Sunday and Monday morning, but that's about it. We're not going to get too cold and then we're definitely going to be warming up in the afternoon. Again, it's easily next week in the mid 80s across the board across our area. Temperatures today though in the mid to upper 70s, maybe across our inland area still feeling pretty pleasant. I think we'll burn up a few of these clouds by this evening to end up for a nice ending. Temperatures tonight will be pretty chilly under mostly clear skies in the low to mid 50s. And then for tomorrow again, mid to upper 70s but still looks fantastic. Now for today, becoming most of the sun again for the waters, northerly winds 10 to 15 knots, moderate chop. Still use caution out there if you're going out in the water. For the beaches, however, there is a risk of rip currents the rest of today. So just be aware of that. No need to really get in the water if you don't have to. It's still pretty chilly as well. Surf two to three feet and sunset at 634. 70 forecast uh, looking really nice. No rain chance through the foreseeable future. Breezy conditions starting up on Wednesday. Again, with that surface area of high pressure being pretty strong, low pressure towards our west. The pressure gradient will tighten and bring us those winds. Look at the temperatures again in the 80s. No change there from about Tuesday onward, maybe even Monday onward. Mostly sunny, a few clouds around, maybe some more clouds by the end of the period and lows back in the mid to upper 60s, a little bit more humid. That's it for now. Another web weather updates coming up later on today.